Hello everybody, this is ATJ013 from GiveMeMine.com and today I'm bringing you a tutorial on how to fake your iOS firmware version. Okay, so first you're going to need some sort of file browser. I'm using iFile. You can also use SSH or your preferred file browser. I recommend iFile, obviously, and so and you'll need a jailbroken iOS device. First I'm going to show you what uh, version I'm on. I'm on 4.3.3 and, and so first you're going to want to go into iFile then scroll down you're going to want to look for a system then a library and then core services and then all the way at the bottom you'll see system version dot p list so select that hit text viewer and this should pop up just hit edit and then you'll be able to edit the text and you see right here it says 4.3.3 if you can see that and then so you just I'm gonna make my I'm gonna fake it to be on 4.3.4. .4. So hit done, save, and there you go. That's basically what's what's what it yeah. That's basically all there is to it. So um, see so now you can see I'm on 4.3.4 .4 right there, and so you don't even have to respring. So and by the way, this exploit was found by me, and um, there's a text tutorial. There will be a link for the text tutorial in the description. And so this is basically this is very useful if you have if there's applications in the App Store or in Cydia that require you to be on another firmware version and only that version or below or above or whatever the case may be. And you by doing this you can fake it and there you go. So and you'll be able to download the application. This does not give you the features of the neck the update or of any update of any kind for the firmware but um so yeah there you go okay guys be sure to follow me on twitter at hj013 and give me mine on twitter and uh comment rate and subscribe thanks guys bye